Hello Mr. Forbes, so this is my final word exam project. Uh, I will be talking about uh, my resume, uh, a cover letter and a newsletter. These are three modules that we have worked on in class for the word. So let me start off with my resume. So uh, this is actually a real life resume about me. So as you know, my name is Jacob Bertlan. I was uh, born and raised in Lévis in uh, Quebec. So a bit of my background, I was uh, actually participated in uh, two English schools, both in primary and high school at St. Vincent and St. Pat's. And uh, I then pursued my studies at, at St. Lawrence within the PW Sims business program, where my goal was really to, uh, to take new knowledge about the business world and to uh, potentially uh, one day have my own uh, business uh, in the retail world, in, in the hardware world. So a bit about my work experience. Uh, I was actually born and raised within a family hardware store. So uh, ever since I was born, I was uh, three to four years old. Uh, I followed my father's footsteps in the hardware store. I would do some cash register. I would follow him on deliveries just simply to watch what he, what he would do. Again, because it's a world that really passions me. So uh, in my work experience, I have worked in the three hardware stores within the, I'd say, six or seven past years. I worked in BMI, uh, worked in the yard. I've uh, delivered, delivered many building products. Uh, then I've also been a salesman. Uh, following this, I was in uh, March 2017 approached by Matériau Beaumat in saint Colas, which is a big hardware store that concentrates on selling to contractors. Uh, my job there was to uh, provide and perform sales with customers and uh, of course to manage employees and customer service. Um, following that, uh, starting in May 2020, so it's pretty recent actually, uh, Jean-Sébastien Saint-Pierre, the owner of uh, Renomat Saint-Étienne, which is under the home hardware banner, uh, called me to be to see if I would be interested in uh, joining his crew uh, to manage employees, a bit the same task as I was doing right now, to be an, to be an assistant supervisor. Following that, uh, my special skills and personal accomplishments, well, of course, I'm bilingual, I speak French and English, uh, at a pretty high level, both in writing and in speaking. I was uh, nominated second place in economics class in high school. So economics, finance is all uh, domains that I am very into and uh, pretty at, at ease with. And I also arrived the 109th on 1,166 at the Levy Oasis 10 kilometer run uh, about two years ago, which that was a pretty big accomplishment for me. Uh, my references are uh, upon request and of course my LinkedIn profile. So to begin with uh, with the modules. So first off is a, a cover letter which uh, actually sums up uh, on top the company Jatre Distribution. And following that, I, uh, I have entered many, many suppliers which I will show you after uh, to explain them my products. So for the 3D printer, uh, I have created a product that is called the 3D board. The 3D board is a 3D printed plywood that I would like to distribute to other suppliers. So in this cover letter, I am explaining about the COVID-19 period and what consequences were then following this period. So because there were lots of inventory problems and shipping problems because sawmills was just simply not supplying the demand. So I'm explaining a bit the advantages of using my product uh, linked to costs and uh, linked to unlimited inventory. So I have created, as I told you, uh, different suppliers. So on each page, you will find different names. Uh, like Yuan Bouchard, you know, like the following one, like the following one, Isabelle Potvin, and all the companies I have named are actually real distribution centers that are linked to the building and lumber materials. So Taiga Building Products is a real distributor, and this is their real address. So I have used Mail Merge uh, to actually uh, send a general email to many different suppliers to actually find a business partner to group up with me 
uh, in Jetrix to distribute this 3D printed plywood. So I will show you quickly uh, all of the different, it's actually the same letter, but with the different, uh, different title merge. So for example, the title is different, uh, the business name is different, the city is different. So, and working with this program is extremely simple because in only one click, you, you can have the same letter, but sent to many different people. So this is really fast to work with. So this is all different suppliers, all different people, but the same letter. So you can see right here, this is my mailing li uh, labels. So these are all the different people to whom I would supposedly send a mail merge. So this you can see right here. Following that, uh, I also did a, a table merge of potential supplier directory. So this is a directory that includes the title, the first name, last name, company, and all of their informations. So as I told you, uh, companies with whom I have included in this project are Taiga Building Products, Goodfellow, Langevin Forest Products, IFL Building Products, and Garon Distribution, which are all real life distribution centers that supply hardware hardware stores. So this right here is a newsletter that I have written uh, to a bit give a summary of uh, what is Jetrix Distribution, uh, what I have created as a product. So just to sum up the letter, uh, I done a monthly newsletter with the 3D board the big name product on top so that people are really hooked by the name and by the style. So I've added a small logo of a tree to explain that we are distributing uh, products that are linked with the forestry industry. But I've also explained that in the history of the lumber market, um, there are no real uh, evolution that are linked to technologies. So this is why this caused uh, a big inventory problem this year because in fact, there are no evolutions in technology from transforming the the tree to a final distribution product for a consumer that wants to, for example, build a, build a project outside of his house. So what I explain here is what is actually 3D printing and how it evolved in a couple of years. And uh, what I have to offer right here is a 3D printed plywood that explain that is named 3D Born and what the advantages are. So uh, it's actually offered uh, and I actually did a uh, a word art, a um, a word art on the right that explained the, the, the different 3D board advantages such as the high performance of the board, the 4x8 format, which is very versatile, the unlimited quantities and the lower costs. And the lower costs are actually linked to the operation because having a 3D printer and printing plywood is much less work than to actually send someone in the forest with a chainsaw, cut down the tree, and then cut this tree in, in 8 feet or 16 feet or 4 feet. And then they have to cut this tree and then put it together to form a plywood and then transport it. So there is many operation fees linked with a real cedar or spruce plywood. So, and I also included a quote that I have written that says, increase your margins and make your company even more profitable to simply catch my audience and so that they see this in big red so it's, so it's catchy that the 3D born can actually increase their profits due to a large number of reasons. Uh, I also explained that uh, we will be distributed strictly to lumber distributors. So we will focus more on business to business rather than business to consumers to give exclusivity to the business so that uh, suppliers can also make a profit selling to hardware stores or direct to consumer. I also added uh, at the end a searching for tab, which explains that Jetrix Distribution is actively searching for a business partner uh, in our province that will accompany uh, the company into launching and distributing the 3D board product. So I would like to uh, thank you for this. Um, all of my documents, my modules will be on my Wix website. 
uh, under my word exam tab which you will have the cover letter zip file and then the two other uh, files for the for the resume and also the newsletter so thank you very much